guess let's engage this guy just to be completionist. Please have mercy, stranger. I'm too old to be a knight. Give me my last rites. I'm trapped in this ring of stone until I rise or fall in a knightly bout. There is no other way for me to earn my freedom. Ah. Uh. Well, Balan's hurt too much, so let's do Mordred. Gains armor for one turn. Okay. Since he's got so much armor, let's do stigma. Only 5% vulnerability. I didn't see he had such a high. Oh well. Power attack. Lost a bunch of armor, but that's okay. Alright. And... Are all- are both of the other two hidden objects way at the bottom? I guess so, because I ain't seeing nothing else. Yeah, be something else in here. A sacred place. What's this? Another bless. Yeah, so there's a couple Take of engage points place. here. What an interesting find. I didn't light up the last one though, so I don't know where that one is. This one is a conjurer who lives and breathes the everlasting flame. Oh. Yeah, okay. They got Bone Totem, Squire, Crossbow, Mpray. 
100% damage to every enemy in two tiles, so he does AoE damage around himself. And another bone totem. Two more crossbows and a squire. Alright. So let's do this. Let's put Mordred over here. Make up your mind. With Sir Ector. Your orders? Put Blonde there. Yvain there. Alright, let's go. I am here to serve. I fight for honor. Okay, so let's move forward. Sinners shall bleed. For my Camelot. There we go. Push him back Before your so I can knock him down. Let me cut you to kill him. I am here to serve at your service, my lord. I don't really want to put that on cooldown. Can I? Alright. Alright, so he's not gonna be able to reach me. Awaiting your command. I am here to serve. Okay, good. I fight for honor. comes the crossbow. I believe they get to attack on their first turn too. Fire? No? Alright. Alright, so that, that was better than I expected then. I fight for honor. So let's move forward, hit him with a power attack. Armor up. Start killing the squire. Before your king. Power and glory. Alright, hopefully that's enough. <laughs> that's why I armed up. Alright. Alright. 
for king and country. Damn. Charge. I am here to serve. Hopefully you can make it out of there. Can I get in an attack over here? Order can do this on his own. Feed the ravens. Get rid of this stupid squire. So I got him down. I am ready. I got one of the totems down. I am here to serve. What are we waiting for? Actually summoned its max amount of bones the lost crossbowmen. I know they had a lot of max amount. I lost a lot of resources on this. Your orders? Your Highness? Okay, so if I can move, attack, and shield charge. 
and she'll charge and she'll charge there we go like accessories sigil for light armor Go. Sigil for heavy armor. Sigil for heavy armor. Is that basically just you just get some items from that? I wasn't sure if it would like have an effect on the mission. So I guess it just is what it is. There's gonna be a fight. Uh, can I come back to it? Yeah, okay. I'll wait and see what my resources look like after I do the main objective. Objective. Those are definitely glitching out. Here we are. My essence resides in that statue. I have to cleanse it to regain my powers. Stand guard until the ritual is complete. As soon as I reveal my presence, the lost ones will come shrieking and should be well within your human lifetime. I hope you will know when the time comes. Okay. He's got 125. Four waves. First one's all commoners, hopefully it stays that way. Huh. And there goes one guy. There we go. 
and you are able to get in range, so let's just overwatch. Alright, wave two. Uh, then I see some crossbows. on him so that he gets vulnerability. Your Highness. Kneel before your king. <laughs> Damn. For king and country. Let's just leave him with tons of points left over. Wire, Commoner, Crossbow, okay, Charge, Too late. Got him. Oh, there's the Crossbow guy right there. For king and country. Yeah, alright, let's... That. Your Highness. Sinners shall bleed. I am here to serve. There we go. Alright, last wave, skirmisher, crossbow, crossbow. Your command? None can stand in my way. <laughs> Sinners shall bleed. He's gonna have one turn left, so let's finish him probably. Because Yvain won't finish him in one turn probably. Awaiting your command. Alright. shot from there either. Okay, good. So at least one crossbow and one skirmisher. And the skirmisher's out of range. on them. Can't charge. The Lord is my witness. At your service, my lord. Regardless, I'm not gonna get in range to actually hit him. Got him. Alright. I didn't think Hector would be able to hit that hard with one hit, but he did. So I lost very little of my resources in that. But I feel like I'm going to have to fight this guy now. And the sacred grounds are free of the undead taint. Your fighting prowess spoke louder 
and the ceaseless mortal bickering. Uh, now I have to rest, to fully regain everything I lost. Your reward is waiting as we agreed. Alright. Interesting find. I thought I'd have to find him also. I think we have enough resources left that we can try and open that trap chest. The Zambi. talking to me dasher 170 doesn't do much damage is a uh not super fast okay i don't worry about him let's move up into range one more just to be sure we're in range Somewhere where I can get a good shot. For Camelot. What? You mean the bleeding? Yeah. Hey, no, oh, he got me knocked back. Yeah, okay, I see that now. That's fine. Still shouldn't be able to attack. Oh, he's smart enough to not get overwatched. Got six, so I can... Sigil... Oh, he's got 100% immunity, damn it. Whatever. Dash, forward, hit. So let's not do power attack right away. Let's move forward, hit, armor up. I see if Hector's in a good spot. He's not. Is that a good spot? One forward? Yeah, I guess so. Alright, so that's not going to make any difference. He does have bleed immunity. Alright, so let's just use my shot. I am ready. Well, luckily I armored up. Now let's hit him with the power attack. I am here to serve. Got him. Out of breath. Didn't lose anything extra from that. 76 gold. Okay. Alright, but we gotta treat Balan. So, we should get K back, but we'll be... Oh, we'll get K and the, um, lady back. Two perception, gain five movement, AP, first turn of each encounter. Doesn't seem crazy useful, actually. The arrival of the Dean. The abbot of the old monastery may be uncomfortably gifted in scheming, but he could also be a worthy ally. 
This time he sent a newly anointed priest to Camelot, who was an excellent orator and a pragmatic mind. According to his letter of commendation, the young dean wasn't bothering me with theoretical problems. Instead, he immediately asked for guidance about what he should preach here. Okay. See, so obedience and loyalty increases his Christian hero's loyalty by one, did drain an ector. Fiery sermons against ancient superstition and blasphemy gives me plus one Christian, lowers the loyalty of Balan. And speeches about peace and justice increases Balan. Okay. I want to move into the Christian thing, and I'm pretty sure Balan has good loyalty already, so let's do that. Yeah, there's his loyalty. Ten, so yeah, he's still he's still pretty good. And we gotta treat him at the cathedral. Okay. Quick will be one mission for 100 gold or free for two missions. But he's also got vitality reduced, so he'd also be have to be treated at the hospice, which will take free three missions. Mm. I gotta get his vitality treated first. The Torment thing's not that big of a deal. Free treatment time reduced. Got two points. Um, also loses armor. Range increase. Fifteen percent damage. Let's go with the range increase because I really like using that as my uh, opener. These all cost two points. Do these just add to your like sweep of abilities so you get more than three? Thunderbolt. Lightning bolt, lightning bolt, lightning bolt. That would be good. Ignoring cover and armor cannot be blocked. I guess let's save that extra point.
plus 25% weapon damage if the target has full HP and vitality. Well, it already pretty much kills people in one hit. Strike causes 20% vulnerability. Oh. I guess let's get both of those then. Earth Shaker. Okay, so I'd give him some sort of ranged attack. Let's see. Let's uh do the AP reduction and I think How much AP does he have? Nine? So if he uses six, I get one back. Well, really, he has eight plus one movement, so eight. So six would give him three. Oh, he'd never have enough to use another force bolt. He would just have enough to use something else. So let's get the one that does increase against hex targets. That way, if I do slowing hex first for only one AP, I'm increasing the damage by 20%. 70% weapon damage to every unit in a 3x3, so that's the good old fireball. Okay. I'll just go ahead and get that. And fire, I'll just give him the full suite of abilities. Alright, so we got Dindrain back, Balan, oh, we got K back also. Alright, I'll do some more management in a little bit. But for now, I'm gonna take a break. <laughs>